Hi everyone, it's Miss Chris from Herrick District Library here with Toddler Story Time today. Yay! The first thing we're going to do today is our feel good chant. And I call it that because the things that we do in the chant make you just feel good about yourself. So I will show you the motions. The first part of the chant goes, I am great. So that means you get your arms way out here. The next part is I am smart where you take your finger and you're touching your head like that. The next part is I am strong. So we want to see some muscles there. The next part is I am loved. That's where you give yourself a hug. And the last part goes like this. Today is going to be an awesome day and you go woohoo and you jump in the air. All right, those are the motions for our feel good chant. Let's do this together. Are you ready? Here we go. Let's get our arms out here. I am great. I am smart. I am strong. I am loved. Today's going to be an awesome day. Woohoo! Good job, everybody, doing our feel good chant today. All right, next up, we're going to sing our opening song. It's we clap and sing hello, except today instead of clapping and singing hello, we're going to wave and sing hello. There are all kinds of ways you can wave. You can wave with this hand. You can wave with this hand. Or my favorite, you can wave with both hands. I like lots of waving, so I'm probably going to do the both handed way. <laughs> Alright, here we go everybody. We wave and sing hello. We wave and sing hello. With our friends at story time, we wave and sing hello. Good waving, everybody. Good job. <laughs> okay, the next song we're going to sing today is called The Waves on the Beach. It's sung to the tune of the people on the bus. And this beach that I'm going to sing about is an ocean beach. We have a lake beach here at Holland. So there are some animals that we're going to meet in this song that belong in the ocean. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to have waves on the beach and they're going to go up and down just like that. And then we're going to meet some crabs on the beach. I'll come up close so you can see the motion for this. But when we have crabs on the beach and they're going to go snap, 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 I want you to take two fingers and your thumb and snap them together. That's our crab snapping. Because then we're going to have the clams on the beach and they go open and shut. So we want to open and shut them. And lastly, we're going to have the sand on the beach and it goes swish, swish, swish. Just like that. Alrighty, are you ready? We're going to start with our waves on the beach. Here we go. The waves on the beach go up and down, up and down, up and down. The waves on the beach go up and down all day long. All right, next we have the crabs. So let's get our two fingers and our thumb and we're going to do some pinching. Actually, crabs pinch, but in this particular verse, they're going to go snap, snap, snap. Here we go. The crabs on the beach go snap, 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 snap. The crabs on the beach go snap, snap, snap all day long. Good job, everybody. All right, next we have our clams on the beach and they go open and shut just like that. Here we go. The clams on the beach go open and shut, open and shut, open and shut. The clams on the beach go open and shut all day long. Good job, everybody. One more verse. The sand at the beach goes swish, swish, swish. So we're going to swish, just like this. Here we go. The sand on the beach goes swish, 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 swish. The sand on the beach goes swish, swish, swish all day long. Good job with our ways on the beach song. Nice job, everybody. Mm -hmm. All right, next we're going to do our counting chant where we're going to count to 10. And it's a chant and not a song, so we don't sing it. So follow along with me. It goes like this. Here we go. I can count 
Want to see? Here's my fingers. One, two, three, four, and five. This hand is done. Now I'll count the other one. Six, seven, eight, and nine. Just one more. I'm doing fine. That last little finger is number 10. Now I'll count them all again. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Great job doing our counting chant. Good job, everybody. Let's see, what is next? Oh, we have. All right, this story time is looking like a day at the beach because our next song is a big sea star. It's to the same tune of a Ram Sam Sam, except it's a big sea star, and we're going to be making some sea animals. So let's see, when we have a big sea star, it looks like this. You put your feet apart, and you put your arms way out, and you make it yourself into a big sea star. There's going to be a little cuddle clam where you're cuddling up like this. And then there's going to be a puffer fish. It doesn't, the puffer fish part isn't as smooth as the regular Ram Sam Sam. Because we go, a puffer fish, and then we puff up our cheeks. Watch. And then we let the air out. A puffer fish. <laughs> little cuddle clam in a big sea star. So it's a little, it's a little bit different. But that is how our song goes. All right, you guys, here we go. We're going to do our big sea star. So let's make our star. Let's see. Let's get our feet out here and our arms out here. Here we go. A big sea star. A big sea star. Little cuddle clam and a big sea star. A big sea star. A big sea star. Little cuddle clam in a big sea star. A puffer fish. <laughs> a puffer fish. <laughs> Little cuddle clam in a big sea star. A puffer fish. <laughs> a puffer fish. <laughs> Little cuddle clam in a big sea star. Good job on the big sea star song. <laughs> that was kind of fun. I tried to have it go slow on that so that we could get all the motions, but you can always speed it up at home when you have the time. <laughs> Good job, everybody. All right, next, I have a friend or two helping me with the next song. Let's see, let me get our friend. Let's see. Our next friend is going to be this guy right here. Do you know what kind of animal this is? Let's see. Here's, I'll give you some hints. Here we go. We have webbed feet down here. We have a bill right here. We have some wings. One wing there, one wing there. And it goes quack, quack, quack. That's right. I have our duck today, and our duck is going to help us. We're going to sing When Ducks Get Up in the Morning. Our duck really wants to help us today. So here we go. We're going to sing our song. Here we go. When ducks get up in the morning, they always say good day. When ducks get up in the morning, they always say good day. Quack, 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 quack. That is what they say. They say quack, quack. Quack, quack. That is what they say. Good job singing with our duck today. Thanks, duck. You were very helpful. What was that? Oh, the duck tells me there's another friend who wants to help us with the song, too. Let's see who we've got. Oh, look here. Here's our other friend. We're going to sing when this gets up in the morning, too. Let's see if we can figure out what kind of animal this is. Hmm. Some of you may have this as a pet at your house. Let's see. We have one ear there, one ear there. We've got some whiskers, some fluffy fur, the fluffy tail back here. Got some paws. Hmm. 
and the sound it makes is meow, meow. What kind of animal is this? That's right, I brought our cat today too, yay. All right, so next we're gonna sing when cats get up in the morning. All right, here we go, everybody. When cats get up in the morning, they always say good day. When cats get up in the morning, they always say good day. Meow, 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 meow. That is what they say, they say. Meow, 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 meow. That is what they say. Good job singing when cats get up in the morning too. Good job, everybody. Our cat appreciates singing with you today. Yay! <laughs> Woo, good job, everybody. All right, I am going to put my cat down over here. There we go. And with all that activity we've just done, it is time for a calm breath break with our Daniel Tiger Squeeze. There's only one motion to the Daniel Tiger Squeeze, and it's this. You're giving yourself a squeeze. Yay! All right, here we go, everybody. Give a squeeze, nice and slow. Take a deep breath and let it go. Let's do, let's do one more. All right, everybody, here we go. Give a squeeze, nice and slow. Take a deep breath and let it go. Whew, good job, everybody. Alrighty, it is time for our early lit tip of the week. Once again, I'm going to use our PLA calendar, that's Public Library Association, and they put out a calendar for every day of the year, and this is our July calendar. Uh, they put out this nice colorful calendar, and each day has a cool, fun thing that you can do together with your toddler that uh, promotes our read, write, sing, song, and play. So today I'm going to emphasize playing for our early literacy tip. And I want to show you how to play the letter of the day game. So when I play the letter of the day game, I have a bag and I am filling it today with things that start with the first letter of my first name. So my name is Miss Chris. So everything in my bag has got to see. Let's see. I will show you what I have in my bag. So let's see. We have today, I think you saw our friend earlier. That's right, I brought our cat because cat starts with a C, just like Miss Chris. So you got Miss Chris and you have a cat. All right, let's see what else is in my bag. So this is a game that you can play with your toddler. You can put things in the bag that starts with their, the letter of your toddler's name too, or you can just pick a letter of your choice and have things in here. I picked the letter C though. So we have our cat today. Let's see, I also have a can. It's also got chicken noodle soup. Lots of C's going on there. So we got Chris, chicken noodle soup, and a can. Lots of C's with this one. What else is in here? I have a library card. Got my library card. It also starts with a C. I have a regular card. You might recognize these from last time around when we were doing our Miss Christmas Motion Minute. So I have a card and I have a car and one more thing. I have a piece of candy. Woohoo! All right, so let's put everything back in the bag. Let's count these as we put them back. Are you ready? Here we go. Here's that piece of candy. One, two, three, four, five, six, six things. There we go, back in the bag. Six things came out of my letter of the day bag. Now at home when you play this, you can put as many things in your bag as you like. You can use whatever kind of bag you like too. That is the early lit tip of the week. Good job, everybody. Alrighty, it is now time to sing our closing rhyme of Tickle the Clouds. I'm going to move my bag a minute. There we go. All right, where are our clouds? When we have clouds, they're way up here, so we're gonna tickle our clouds. Tickle the clouds. 
Now tickle your toes. Way down here by the floor. Now turn around. And tickle your nose. <laughs> reach down low. Down by the floor again. And reach up high. Way up here. Woohoo! Our story time is over. So wave goodbye. Bye, everybody. Thanks for coming to story time today. We'll see you next time.